Hey YouTube, this is Dean making another vid. If you like my content, please consider hitting the like button. Also, please consider subscribing as it is very much appreciated. Been busy again today. Um, built the last of the non-forged antler builds that I'm going to do. This time it's a much bigger one. Used a Nicholson file from Brazil. Um, 6.3 millimeter strike face. Just under 85 mils long. It's 84.7 mils long. Again, just friction fitted into the channel. I made sure it was a little bit smaller than the channel this time. Couldn't get it to fit right down into the bottom of the channel because it actually stacks up as you're jamming it in there. It is very tight, won't come out. Um, again, they spark really well. Um, these Nicholson files tend to spark really well. As I said, just snapped off files tend to spark really well. No worries. There's the little one I did yesterday, and there's the one I did today. As far as I'm concerned, this is about probably the best builds you can do for fire builds, uh, file builds. If you want to look at make them look a little bit better than just a file snapped off. I I really like them, and especially if you can get your hands on antler. And I'm finding you can buy it at Pet Barn as as um, dog chews. So I bought a big piece of antler for 30 bucks. Uh, it sounds expensive. It is a bit expensive. But, um, yeah, they're, they're, they are available. If you can get it, um, like, harvest it if you got deer you go deer shooting and you can harvest it without having to buy it it's even better um no dramas whatsoever I'd, that's be what i'd be doing and if you um as i said if you're just using snapped or files it's a really professional look you know like Not a problem. Like they. But I just wanted to show you there's um the yeah, these are these are a great build. I, I'm I'm really happy I'd done it. It was quite easy to do. Um I I didn't have much problem. It took me about I don't know, forty five minutes at the most fooling around with it. And I am no craftsman as far as that goes. Um I don't tend to do these sort of things that much. I try to avoid the sort of the sort of crafting things a bit. As far as that goes, um, I've got several landed there. I'm getting embers, no dramas, you know. Oh, I've got a couple there. Right? I'm not burning my fingers. Anyway, I won't waste charcoal. Off. As you saw, it sparks really well. You get onto a sharp edge. So, it's sharing sparks. And as this little one does too. It had some, it's getting a bit blunt there. So no worries. Anyway, I just wanted to show you my antler builds using Nicholson files broken off and just friction fitted in. I just cut the channels out, made sure they were a fairly tight fit in there and then just whacked them in and um, I cleaned them up all on a grinder, um, making sure that they I kept them cool so that they didn't lose their, lose their um, hardness. And there they are. Just a good look around them nice thick strike face on this one that's what I wanted for it nice piece of antler really well textured and nice and interesting looking made sure I rounded off the antler there it feels really good in the hand you know like you, you basically use it sort of like that this one's the same
this one's a bit thinner, but I had to for this size antler piece. There they are together. But anyway, they're my antler builds, non-forged. I'm only going to do forged ones from now on. I've got another, another, I think I've got three pieces. One large piece left and a couple of small tines left. And then I'm going to, um, yeah, I'm only going to do forged ones left now. So, yeah, they'll be coming up in the next couple of weeks. Anyway, thanks for watching.